Uh, this is going to be a really quick a little video here. Um, but I just want to show folks how to download their pickle files from uh, Runway. So let's say you've uh, trained a Runway model style GAN. Um, and for whatever reason you want to download your pickle file, maybe you want to bring it into Colabs, you can um, use some of the tools that I have demoed in other uh, videos. Um, it's pretty easy to actually download your uh, your pickle files from Runway. So let's quickly look at it. Um, so obviously here I'm in inside of the training uh, section. So you've got your workspaces, your models, and training. Um, so you'll see here I have a bunch of completed models. Uh, if I click on any one of these, um, you'll see that this is basically a, a completed training. Uh, you'll see your save video here. And then right down here, you'll see that there is a selected checkpoint. Um, and if you click change, uh, you'll see there's a little menu here. And I'm on a small little laptop, so it's actually hard to tell that you can scroll um, once these are open. Uh, it actually kind of looks like it's closed. Uh, but you can scroll here, and what you'll see is all the way at step one, um, 500, 1,000, 1,500, 2,000. So it's basically every 500 steps you're able to download that file from it. Um, I'm just going to download my latest, which is the step 5,000. And if you just come over here and you click this button um, and you hit download, you'll see that now it opens a place for you to put a destination in. So I'm just going to stick in my downloads. Um, it names it whatever you've named your uh, file here, and you just hit save. Um, and I think it's probably going to take a little bit of time there to download because um, it should be a pretty big file. Yeah, so it's definitely going to take some time to download. Oh, here we go. It's popped up here, so you'll see. Uh, I mean, these are fairly large files, about 310 megabytes, so it will take a little bit of time to download. Looks about 30 minutes. Um, so when this is done, I'll, I'll pretty much be ready to go. Um, you don't really need, if you're just going to uh, use your training inside of uh, Runway, you don't really need to download it. Um, you know, I don't expect uh, Runway to like delete your files or anything anytime soon, um, but it is there if you want to use it. Uh, maybe you also want to download it so you can do some mixed model stuff in Colab or something. Um, so that's pretty much it. Uh, just a really quick one, because um, sometimes it is sort of hard to find out where to download this. Um, while I have you here, I just want to mention that I have a class that is starting um, in about two weeks um, that is all about Runway. Uh, it's going to be a five week long class, um, about an hour and a half a week of lectures. Um, it starts at on Tuesday, April 7th at uh, 8.30 p.m. Eastern Standard Time. So it should work if you're in North America. Um, we're going to go through pretty much features like this. We're going to go through every single feature inside of Runway. Um, so I'll post the link to sign up for the class. Um, we have pretty small class sizes, and it's a lot of one-on-one -on -one time with me and an opportunity to ask a lot of questions. Um, so if you're interested, uh, go ahead and sign up, and I'll see you there. Um, otherwise, thanks for watching this video.